Hi everyone, I hope everything is going well with everyone. Um, I finished my Halloween series the other day and I said I was moving to my Christmas series and one of my subbies, who I know very well, asked me what happened to Thanksgiving. Being that Halloween and Christmas are my favorite holidays, I figured I was just going to do those two. So I decided to do a couple, like a mini series for Thanksgiving. And I'm trying to find images for Thanksgiving, which is hard to find. But I'm going to do a couple of cards. So I hope you guys like the first one. Enjoy. For my first card, I started with this um, Chrissy Digi image from whimsystamps.com. And it's called Turk in Boots. And I printed two images, and I'm going to color both. And... I'm going to color them up with my Copics. Here we go. Once I finished my coloring, I cut out um, my two little guys. Um, I left one of them as is, and one of them I actually cut in three pieces. I cut the body of the turkey and two pieces of the um, what is that wings or feathers in the back. So at first I was gonna use um, this white circle, and I thought the white was too much. On the background so at the end of the card I actually use a different color but I glued my first turkey flat onto my circle and then I'm gonna use some dimensionals to glue the other parts of the other turkey that I cut apart so I'm gonna add here I was gonna add here the feathers first then I decided I should put the body of the turkey first. I'm sorry, um, I'm kind of out of view. Didn't realize my camera was not um, centered. But I'm adding um, the thicker dimensionals to the body of the turkey. And I'm just going to add, adhere it to the center over the body of the other tur turkey.
so. And then I'm gonna add here the feathers. And I actually use a thinner dimensional so I to create um, a dimensional look. Like so. Let's remove my backing. My turkey looks like. For my card, I started with um, a two size card in craft um, cardstock, and I used this paper pad from Me and My Big Ideas, and I used my Martha Stewart flower bed deep edge punch. To cut this two and a half inch piece of decorative paper and I glue it across my front of my card and then I use my spell binders lacy circles die set and cut this um, circle in some brown cardstock and I had here my turkey and I'm just gonna glue it straight flat to the card Like so. Then I use this punch um, from Imagination and I punched out one leaf in the orange cut cut that I use in the background. And I'm just gonna adhere it like right here, like so. Then for the sentiment, I used this ever thoughtful stamp, and I actually purchased it at Michael's on the dollar fifty bin. Then I used my modern label punch from Stampin' Up to punch out my sentiment. Then I used my Stampin' Up basic black ink, and I just distressed the edges a little of my sentiment. And then I'm just gonna adhere it to the front. in the front of my card but inside I use this stamp set from I believe Inga Dinka Do and my latte stamp I'm sorry ink pad from Hero Arts and I just punched two more eight leaves using the orange paper from the front and just adhere it next to the sentiment inside and that's pretty much my card for today um, I added some stickles to my pumpkin and the shoes, the shoes and the hat, and that was it. I want to thank you guys for watching, and I hope you like enjoy my mini series for Thanksgiving, and hopefully my Christmas series will be starting soon. Thank you guys again. Have a good weekend. Bye.